Uh, I was born and raised in Nizhny Novgorod, Russia. I moved here when I was uh, about 20 years old. Yeah, I enrolled in BMCC and I took communications program. Before coming to United States, uh, I was in like pharmacy school in Samarkand. So I came to United States in 2010. Uh, after finishing my Forest Hills High School, so I had a choice to go like many uh, community colleges, but I chose BMCC because I felt like BMCC is kind of different. Like I went to like the other colleges and like I didn't feel the same way that I felt in BMCC. I'm interested in media studies in particular. Within that, I'm interested in gender studies and cultural studies. Uh, I started my BMCC career like in 2011. So I started with a science major and I thought uh, for medical schools they require like a lot of uh, extracellular activities and the research is like main, um, a main thing they will look for it. So I started with our Professor Navar, my research last summer, exact the same time. The project I did uh, last semester, it's, it, initially it started as an honors project at BMCC. I did it within uh, my mass media class with uh, Professor Zukic, who is my mentor. The topic of this project is uh, representation of women in advertising. Basically, our project was like elimination of like heavy metals from wastewaters by using low-cost uh, materials such as uh, alginate beads, um, like span tea leaves. As a communication student and uh, young women myself, I've become troubled by the sexualized representation of women and advertising. So I decided to examine advertising images to understand how representation of women affects uh, women in real life. I did honors uh, with Professor Navarro, and after my honors, there was uh, Professor Geddes. He mentioned to my mentor about Beacon Conference, because um, the, after evaluating my honors paper, they really liked my paper, and they told me to like submit everything to Beacon Conference. And we did submit our papers, and after like two months, uh, we got response from them, and they told me like I got accepted, and so I'm a. I'll be a presenter at Beacon Conference. I found out about the conference through BMCC when I completed my honors project and I submitted my paper there online and then I was chosen as a Beacon Scholar and I was uh, chosen as a speaker to come and present my paper at the conference. So obviously I went there and I presented my paper in the communications category and I won in the category, yeah. I believe like I was selected in my area because because of like outstanding research and outstanding uh, paper submission. It felt great because it was an encouragement. It's it's like a validation of your hard work. So you really get an idea on what would you do next. It encourages you to continue this research, to continue and maybe submit this paper to some journals and explore the topic more. As a mentor, uh, Dr. Navarra is like amazing mentor because like he, he is here always to help to his students and with everything like no matter what. So basically when we start the research project like I had no idea like what's going on in there. After like I started doing the research by myself like reading articles and everything else and like I learned a lot of, about this project when there was like beacon conference time so we collected everything every information and put it in one so that the outcome result was amazing which uh, we got the beacon awards. The relationship with Professor Zukic is uh, very valuable to me since I'm an adult student and I'm here by myself I, I I really don't have any guidance from anybody else. So Professor Zukic is uh, such an amazing and kind person who is honestly and earnestly interested in her students' lives. And she, she truly takes time to understand students' interests and to, she takes so much time to work with her students. She was right with me from the very beginning to the very end. 
of this project. She helped me uh, prepare for my defense at BMCC. So we practiced my speeches in the communications department 30 minutes before I had to go and present the project. I think yeah, Beacon Conference recognition will help me a lot as an outstanding like applicant among others because Beacon Conference, as I mentioned, is like very competitive conference. It's not easy to become outstanding presenter because there are a lot of like strong candidates between like a lot of students. There's only one place that's like outstanding presenter. That's why like I think it should help me a lot to become an outstanding applicant on my application to medical schools.